Swords of Mars, by Edgar Rice Burroughs continues the adventures of John Carter, Warlord of Mars. The novel is set in the vivid and richly imagined world of Barsoom, where Carter faces new challenges and enemies. The narrative weaves together elements of science fiction and fantasy, creating a tapestry of adventure and intrigue. John Carter, the protagonist, is characterized by his unwavering bravery and moral integrity. These traits are put to the test as he undertakes a mission to infiltrate the Guild of Assassins in Zodanga. Carter's mission is twofold, to disrupt the activities of this dangerous organization and to rescue Dejah Thoris, his beloved wife, who has been abducted. Carter's journey through Zodanga is fraught with peril, but his resilience and combat prowess shine through as he navigates the treacherous landscape. The theme of loyalty is central to the narrative. Carter's devotion to Dejah Thoris drives much of the plot, highlighting the strength of their bond. This loyalty extends beyond personal relationships to his sense of duty toward Barsoom. Carter's commitment to justice and his willingness to risk his life for the greater good underscore his heroism. Burroughs excels in creating a sense of place. The depiction of Barsoom is vivid and immersive, with its alien landscapes, strange creatures, and advanced technologies. The world-building is intricate, drawing readers into a fully realized universe. This attention to detail enhances the sense of adventure, as the reader is transported to a land where danger and wonder coexist. The novel's pacing is brisk, with action sequences that keep the reader engaged. Carter's encounters with various adversaries are described with a dynamic energy that captures the excitement of battle. These scenes are balanced with moments of introspection, as Carter reflects on his motivations and the stakes of his mission. This balance between action and character development adds depth to the narrative. A notable aspect of Swords of Mars is its exploration of the theme of identity. Carter's infiltration of the Assassin's Guild requires him to adopt a new persona. This subterfuge forces him to grapple with questions of self and the nature of disguise. The duality of his existence, both as a leader and a covert operative, adds complexity to his character. This exploration of identity is mirrored in the broader context of Barsoom, a world where appearances can be deceiving and alliances are constantly shifting. The novel also delves into the concept of power. The Assassin's Guild represents a threat not only to Carter but to the stability of Barsoom. The struggle against this clandestine organization highlights the corrupting influence of unchecked power. Carter's mission is not just a personal vendetta but a fight against tyranny. This theme resonates with broader questions about governance and the responsibilities of those in power. Burroughs' writing style is characterized by its descriptive richness and imaginative scope. His prose brings the world of Barsoom to life making the fantastical elements feel tangible. The dialogue is imbued with a sense of formality that suits the epic nature of the story, yet it also conveys the emotional stakes of the characters. Burroughs' ability to blend the epic with the personal is a hallmark of his storytelling. Swords of Mars is a testament to Burroughs' skill as a storyteller. The novel combines thrilling action with thoughtful exploration of themes such as loyalty, identity, and power. John Carter's journey is both a personal odyssey and a larger-than-life adventure, set against the backdrop of a vividly imagined world. Through Carter's eyes, readers are invited to explore the wonders and dangers of Barsoom, experiencing the excitement and challenges of a hero's quest. Burroughs' creation is a timeless work that continues to captivate readers with its blend of fantasy, science fiction, and adventure.